It's day six of our daily journal for people investigating the basics of Christianity. And today we're looking at the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5. So Paul had established a church in Corinth 2,000 years ago, and then he wrote a couple of letters to them. This is the second letter. And so remember, these are Christians that Paul is writing to. And here's what he says to them. And this is so great for you, whether you're a Christian or whether you're thinking about becoming one. In verse 17, it says this. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away, and behold, the new has come. So what Paul is talking about is if you have placed your faith in Christ, if you have trusted him for salvation, as opposed to trying to trust in your own works, to be a better person. Or I guess on the other side, trusting that there's no way that what Jesus did on the cross could cover over all of your sins. No, Paul is saying this, if you have put your faith in Christ, you are a new person. It's almost like in the court of heaven, there's a reality about you that might not be obvious yet here on earth. But it's true, it says the old has passed away and the new has come. Now, for you, if you're a Christian, this is one of those verses that I would really memorize, because this is the truth about you if you have put your faith in Christ. Now, if you're someone who has not yet put your faith in Christ, then this isn't yet true about you. So make sure to do that. We call that in our resources, getting to your defining moment or your faith moment. And you can talk about that with a friend or a mentor If you have not put your faith in Christ, then you're still broken and you're still infected by your sin. But if you've put your faith in Christ, you're a new creation. The old has passed away and the new has come. Journal on this. Think about this and apply it to your own life. And we'll see you in the next video.